moved the football team, um, played uh, played very very well. Yeah, he's uh, he did he did a lot, and um, you know from the from the first time he went in there, you know, he, just feeling the feeling the, the deep zone and feeling the linebackers drop and just taking that extra extra half second to take a, take a breath and hit the check down. Uh, just a uh, was uh, was good ball. You know, he was he was good. Front left to John. Coach Brandon himself said that his biggest advance from fall camp was his communication. How much did he address the things that you talked about before the season? Um, well, he's made uh, made big strides and uh, really good um, in that area. Yeah, it's been uh, and, and was good and was good out there today. Steve. Jim, what did you what did you see on the on the touchdown pass to Chris Evans? Did, did, did I thought Chris made a heck of a catch on it. Uh, you know, I thought Brandon saw it well, good protection, um, and you know, Brandon put it put it uh, put it you know, a little short, but uh, Chris adjusted well with the ball and made a nice catch. And then the next time out, he had a two minute drill. What, what impressed you the most about Brandon's game today? Today. Um, well, the, the things I talked about earlier. I mean, uh, just that he was, he was, he was playing the position. He was playing. He was playing good ball. Um, two minute drill. I think that's definitely. You know, that's a. That's a real. Uh, bright spot. You know, to go in there. I mean, was it his second drive? I think, and, and, and get organized uh, and, and get our team organized in the two minute drill on the field. Uh, that's something. Quarterback doesn't usually have happen to him on the second drive of, of playing football. But, um, yeah, I think it re re really well for him today. That, that was and that was great to see. Back left, <clears throat> coach. Um, obviously, the quarterback position has been one of really high contention all season long by the fan base. Um, at what moment did you decide it was right to make the switch to Peters and why? We had made, we had made that decision uh, uh, before before well before the game that he was going to play in the game. We're going to put him in. It was time. It was time for him to play. Metal back, coach. Outside of a few plays that the defense gave up today, how happy were you in their performance today compared to last week at Penn State? Uh, I just keep keep uh, admiring the way how hard they play. Um, you know, our guys are really really competing, really really working, straining when they're out there. I think that showed up defensively. Forty some plays and they give up fifty some yards. Uh, three plays where they gave up over a hundred, but um, that uh, hard working unit and uh, played very well today. <coughs> Back right, Coach Nick. Jim, I'm curious when you go when, when Brandon does go in the game for you, uh, you know you guys obviously prepared him as best you thought you could, but at some point he has to go in the game. What are you thinking as a coach when it's like okay, you know you're in, we'll see. I mean, what, what was your, you know, were you nervous for him? Were you, were you just, did you expect him to go out and, and play well, or what was your? I was. I'm mean, curious what's going on in your head at that point. Uh, no, I mean, I thought I thought he was ready. I mean, you base you base a lot of things on practice. Um, you know, good in practice, good in the games. Um, and now that's not always the case, especially with young players. Um, that uh, you know, some guys sometimes they're not good in the games, and, and they're good good in practice. But uh, you know, it was it was great to see him be good in the game too. Uh, that was uh, that was good. And that's something that. Young players, uh, when they're good in the games, they get that helps their confidence. That, that builds the that builds the confidence. But uh, we all felt we all felt good. Nobody was uh, more nervous uh, about what was going to happen. Um, and we thought he'd be thought he'd do good. Front left again, Steve. I think he did better than everybody thought, too. Well, that was my question. I mean, did, yeah. he, did he exceed what you thought you'd get from him? In a game like this, right? from where he's at right now in his development. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, that was 
Yes, yes, I'll say that. Right. Then you're going through the consistently. I mean, every drive he was moving the moving the team and uh, touchdown drive on the two minute drill or uh, 80 yard drive or 75 yard drive to you know, start his, his first series in, in football. Uh, starting quarterback in college, that was. I, I would think that uh, that'd be very good for good for his confidence and you know and build on it. We'll have to build on that.